I'm Patty Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is summer fun. I'm going to take two fingers right about here and put a dot. And from that dot I'm going to draw curve line down, curve line up, curve line over, connect. I take one finger right about here and I put another dot and I'm going to draw curve line down, curve line over, curve line up, connect. I come back to the left and right here at the top I'm just going to draw a curve line in, down, connect, come back to the dot, curve line down, out, connect. Starting underneath I'm going to mimic that inside line, connect, and right at the top I'm going to draw a slightly curved line down, over, up, connect. Now I come over to this side, right where the dot is, I'm going to draw a curve line out, down, connect, come back to the dot, curve line down, connect, come inside, mimic that line, curve line up, over, down, connect, come up on the top, curve line over, curve line down, curve line over, and connect. Right down here, I'm going to put a dot, and I'm going to draw a baby circle. Then right above that, I put another dot, and now I'm going to draw a bigger circle. Inside, I'm going to draw a curve line out to the edge, connect, curve line out, keep going, out to the edge and connect and I wanted to have some movement so I put two little curve lines, these are animation lines, two little curve lines on top. Now I come right about here, put a dot, I'm going to draw a straight line out, come back to the dot, straight line out. Right at the dot I draw a straight line down. Then inside I draw one, two on the left, straight diagonals, one, two on the right, straight diagonals. I come back to the left and I draw curve line, curve line, connect. Curve line, curve line, connect. Curve line, curve line, connect. And now we go down. Curve line, curve line, connect. Curve line, curve line, connect. Curve line, curve line, connect. Okay. Now I come over here to the left and let's put a dot right there. And from that dot, I'm going to draw a wavy, wavy, wavy line down. Leave it floating. Come back to the dot. Wavy, wavy, wavy line over and connect. I draw one straight diagonal down, one straight diagonal up, connect. Inside I draw one, two, three, four diagonal lines and now curve line down, up, connect, curve line down, up, connect, maybe one more if you can fit it, curve line down, up, connect. I come over here on the right and I'm just going to draw a straight diagonal, come back to the left, curve line down, up, connect, let's draw it again, curve line down, up, connect. Inside, curve line down, up, connect, curve line down, up, connect, curve line down, up, connect. See if you can fit curve line down, up, connect. One more curve line down, up, connect. Now, right here, I'm just going to put a dot 
And I'm going to draw a little curved line. Bigger curved line up, down, leave it floating. Bigger curved line up, down, connect. Inside, I'm just going to draw a curved line, curved line, connect on the right. Curve line, curve line, connect on the left. Inside, I just do wavy, wavy line on the right, wavy, wavy line on the left. Now, wherever you have space, this is going to be different for everybody. We're just going to draw a big curve line, leave it floating, and come back, and we're just going to go curve line, curve line, curve line, curve line. Curve line, connect, inside, one, two dots, big curve line up, little curve line, little curve line. Okay, wherever you have a space, we're just going to draw curve lines, curve lines, curve lines, and everybody's going to have a different amount because we all draw differently, but we're filling in this space with curved lines. Okay, let's see how we are going to color this in. Okay, I am going to start with yellow because I seem to have a lot of yellow going on in this drawing. Now, a lot of these you can color any color you want. These are just what I used. So for the inside space, on this object, I'm using my yellow. I come down here and I pick two spaces on this to color yellow. And then I come up here and I color in this space yellow. And I just color I'm kind of doing an up, down, up, down, up, down on this space and I color this in yellow. Because we don't have a line on the bottom part, it's okay for your yellow to kind of blend in to the rest of the paper. Okay, so there's my yellow. Next, I used yellow green to color in this space and this space on the right and yellow green for this space and this space on the left and again you can color yours any color you wish I'm going to put a little bit of yellow green on this space also okay next I'm going to take my blue-green turquoise and I'm just going to add some curved lines underneath my black lines that I drew to kind of fill in this space. Okay. Then I'm taking my regular blue and I'm coloring in this space and this space right and left. And I'm going to come down and I'm going to color this space and this space blue, regular blue. Next, red. I'm going to color the outside of this red. And again, these can be any color you want. I am going to make this red. First, I'm going to do some curved lines with my red and come back to that. This should be red. That's pretty standard coloring. You'll do a better job than me, as always. Let's see, and this down here should be red. One, two. Okay? Next, I'm taking my pink and I'm going over my red curved lines on this space. And that's because I wanted this to be strawberry, but maybe you want a different flavor. I'm doing these pink 
also. And I'm going to come over here and I'm going to do this space pink, which you also can color any color you want. This is the color I chose. I'm going to make these spaces black as they should be. I'm going to add some dark green lines down here at the bottom just to give a two-tone color there. And finally, I'm going to color in this space brown which also you can color any color you want. Now, because this is my drawing, I'm taking a peach or an apricot. This could be orange or yellow, and I'm filling in the background. Because if you kind of look at what's going on, it almost looks like a beach, fun summer, or the lake. Or some place that has water sports. And I just want a neutral color for the background. Okay, let's see what this looks like all colored in. Okay, here is my summer fun all colored in. Okay, bye-bye.